In the past, I was one of those femme hater gay guys. Not that I'm the most masculine gay on earth <laughs> by any means, but I just had a prejudice against the super feminine guys, very, you know, animated and la la la. You know the ones I'm talking about. And I managed to get past that prejudice uh, just by realizing that that's a prejudice I have against myself, against when I was young and I was told, you know, to be more masculine and I was bullied for being the feminine little boy. But there's one type of gay that I still, mm, I just really have a prejudice still against this particular type of gay, which is the bitchy, queeny gay. In particular, I've been seeing this on YouTube with these drama channels, and there are a couple gay guys who are particularly catty and queeny and bitchy and it just to me is a stereotype of the gay community which is a negative stereotype i mean i guess a lot of defensiveness comes from being marginalized or being discriminated against. Gay people, feminine guys, masculine women have always been outcasts and, and picked on and that can cause us to react by putting up this whole wall and, and going the complete opposite way and becoming very defensive and, and attacking rather than being attacked. But I just, I just, ugh. I still, that whole queenie, ugh, I just, it just, it just does something to me. It really bugs me. And obviously, I'm the one being bothered by it, so I'm the one that's hurting myself over it. These people don't care at all what I think. <laughs> it doesn't bother them to uh, know that I judge them and don't like them. So obviously when you're judging somebody like that, you're only hurting yourself. So I know that, but for some reason I just can't get past it. It just bugs me so much. Ugh. That, the whole, and I don't know, maybe it, maybe it feels like fake to me, or maybe I feel like that's not who they really are, and that's just an act they're putting on. I know a lot of stuff is done on YouTube just for views, and people, you know, amp up their personality, and emphasize certain things, and do it for the drama, and do it for, for the views to be someone that stands out I don't know I don't know I'm just too old for this I can't I just can't but anyway I know that's something that I have to get over because obviously if it bothers me it just I'm just hurting myself I'm spending time focusing on something that's causing me anguish I'm causing myself anguish over something and that's doing no good for anything. That's not doing any good for me, for my mental health, for anyone around me, or for the world. So, anyway, I guess I just have to work on that. 